Okay, everybody, we are back now with more of Birth by Sleep Final Mix. Last time we pretty much did the introduction with Terra. And yeah, that's how I'm doing things. So we head here. With a combat level of one, we arrive in the Enchanted Dominion. Monsters. The ones the Master mentioned. These are the Unversed. And yeah, we now gotta deal with the Unversed. They're pretty much the heartless of this game, and they only make their appearance in this game. Not that I have anything wrong with it. After all, we get to beat them down and be able to get stronger and process. I take this guy. Right? And now they got different varieties along with it. And now is this critical impact. Terra specializes in power, and power is what makes Terra what he is. Eat this. Ow, really? Are you gonna do this now? Ask him. And yeah, Terra starts off being a bit limited at first, but as you go on and keep on going in this game, well, he starts to unlock new stuff that can make him stronger. And that's what I hope to do. And there you go. Yon and Yon. Looks like now we gotta hunt him down. But before we do, let's see if we can get our hands on some needed items. Yeah, there are chests here, and to get 100% completion in this game, you have to actually look and find every single chest that's there. Sometimes you'll find items that can help you. Other times, well, you just gotta explore. And that's what I like about this. I still remember enjoying this on the PSP and my first experience playing Critical Mode. In Critical Mode, yeah, it's no laughing matter. Alright, we arrive here, there's our save point as usual, and we get our hands on an obtainable item. That's gonna be needed for something much later. Nice, we get our hands on a new spell. We may as well modify our deck. Anyway, if you wonder what these stickers are, they're for this, the sticker album. What you need to do is take these stickers and arrange them. And yeah, you can tell that you'll get a certain number of points, and the more points you get, the more rewards. Completing it all will probably get you like some nice new stuff. And this is what the redeemable is for. You get the Pulsing Crystal, Fireworks, Limit Storm, Sonic Blade, and when you reach the max, you obtain a new Command Style, Rhythm Mixer. If you are playing Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep Final Mix on the PSP and you have a save file of Birth by Sleep, the Japanese version, you can be able to unlock it a lot sooner. Now let's add a little bit of a blizzard to the mix. That makes it easier. And I'm not going to be worrying about the melding commands yet. I will devote a bit of time to grinding so that way I can get what I need. Besides, that's what's for. And that pulsing crystal looks like a mithril crystal to me. Anyway, let's move.
of this? Why aren't you asleep, boy? That fool Flora cast a spell to put everyone in this castle into a deep, deep slumber. Who are you? Why, I am Maleficent, as all who dwell in this kingdom would know. Now you must reciprocate the introduction. Who are you? I'm Terra. What do you know about those monsters? The ones who attacked me? Hmm. Now why would I give a thought to creatures so base, so inconsequential? <laughs> well, they are base. That's for sure. Anyway, I'm looking for someone. Ever heard of a man named Xehanort? That name is not familiar to me. Is he an outsider like yourself? Oh, but wait. I do remember someone leaving the castle. Tell me, what was he doing there? I couldn't say. I can only be certain he was not from this kingdom. If you're curious, go see the castle for yourself. There, the entrance is past the bridge. Thanks. <laughs> Perhaps he did speak about imprisoning the light. The light could be so many things. Could he have meant Princess Aurora? Aurora. Terra, I swear you're being such a bloody dummy. I don't know why, but he just is. Anyway, may as well take advantage of this opportunity and use D-Link. Yeah, I'm doing this so that way I can be able to max him out. And that's necessary. And yeah, Terrace does specialize in power. He also kind of lacks the magic needed to be do it. But don't worry, you can be able to boost the magic as you progress. Yeah, that works. That got him, and now we get another potion. So yeah, as much as I like Terra's characterization, my only problem with Terra is the fact is that he can be extremely gullible. And that to me is gonna end up doing more harm than good. Oh look, now we get a magic deflect. By collecting one of these, you can upgrade. You're gonna need those upgrades so you can be able to survive. So long. Oh, here comes the trouble. Gather. Take that. Yeah, like that. Automatic magic deflecting. And your commands will level up as they get stronger. So keep this in mind. And there will be a part where I will go back and clean things up. Trust me. Hmm, not bad. And now the enemy's coming. And now let's kick the critical impact in the gear. I feel like for some weird reason the controls for this don't mesh well, especially since it's now on the PS4. Eat this. Painful, isn't it? Nice. Terra leveled up to level 2, and as you level up, you'll unlock new, new stats, like improvements for his stats, etc. And that's what you're going to get most of the time. Now, let's see where this is going to lead us. Here we go. How dare you? Yeah, that should teach you. Oh, 
most of the time the lock on just doesn't work. And that to me is what makes it hard. And if I were you, I'd take the opportunity to level up and grind, because you're going to need it. Yeah, that got him. This feels so familiar. Her heart is filled with light. Not the slightest touch of darkness. Just the kind of heart I need. For what? Imagine with me the most glorious of futures. Seven of the purest hearts, each overflowing with light. When brought together, they grant the power to rule all worlds. What do you mean? Why, that key you hold. The Keyblade, is it called? Where did you learn that name? That trinket is the only way to obtain the hearts. No more games! Where is Master Xehanort? Impudence will get you nowhere, child. If you wish to learn more, you must retrieve the heart of Aurora. And why would I ever want to do that? It's not a matter of why, but of will. In your heart, there is darkness just waiting to be awakened. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Perhaps not yet. But I have power over sleep. And I can awaken what's inside you. Then you will be free to be who you truly are. Remember that darkness lurks in every heart. Darkness is our foe. Would that we could be rid of it. You must destroy it. Push the darkness down. Give it no quarter in your heart. Waited for. To think that all he spoke of was and will be true. What? How did I. <sighs> what did I do? What did you do? You speak as if I pulled some invisible strings. No. You couldn't be further from the truth, child. I simply whispered to the darkness you already held inside. How could I do this? Finn! Yes. Now, you want to know where Xehanort went. Well, that I cannot answer. He disappeared into the darkness. But now I know the Keyblade is necessary to gather hearts. Join me. Collect six more hearts of pure light. Then we will rule all the worlds together! You seem to be mixed up. I'm a peacekeeper, not a tyrant.
Hmm. For a peacekeeper, you're off to an exceptionally poor start. Remember this. The darkness in your heart cannot be held back by force or strength. Now, my work here is done, as is yours. Wasn't there someone you needed to chase? The Unburst. They're gonna bring down the castle. I have to do something. Terra, you bloody dummy! Oi! We forged a D-Link with Maleficent, but that truthfully is not important. What is, is Terra being a complete and utter dunce. I mean, seriously, Terra. Why? Yeah, and there's a reason why I truthfully do not like his characterization. This to me really makes me upset at times. Oh, and getting this nets us an attack recipe. A recipe list that reveals what you will create if your melding combination will result in a basic attack command. This is useful if you want to build up numerous commands for your deck. And speaking of which, we have a Moogle shop. And there are loads of different attacks at our disposal. We can also get healing items, too. But we don't really need that much. So for now, we need to move. Honestly, what were you thinking, Terra? Wait. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Our gauges must need to be filled up. That's why. The Unversed are like the Heartless. The only difference is that, well, they don't have much in terms of variety. Oh, you were able to avoid that. Not bad. I cannot say the same for how messy it is. That should do it. Now let's see what Maleficent's all about. Yeah, I still am upset. I still remember it back in 2010, and I remember it again even now. Tara, what were you thinking? It's the good news is we love it. I'm gonna need at least planks so that way to survive this. Take that! Yeah, that should do it. Nice. And that levels it up, so we can have a focus save. But it also unlocks the new commands. And this is not good. Yeah, and hearing this sound effect is one that's gonna get really tiring really fast. Much better. But that will not be enough for us. Will it be if we try to survive? Who knows? But we have a boss battle to deal with. Our objective here is to take on the boss at hand. This is the Wheelmaster. And yeah, since this is the final mix version, the Wheelmaster comes in a different sort of color. Really, that's all? Ah, and yeah, we go down. But here's one thing that I like about this. Instead of just continuing, you have the option to try again. Saves you a lot of trouble. And I wish Shelby would actually knew about this. Anyway, we have to take on the Unversed. What you see here is the Wheelmaster. The Wheelmaster's no laughing matter here, folks. This guy is dangerous if you're not prepared. 
combat, I learn it the hard way. Take that. Nice effort, but it won't work. Here we go. Now I can keep on attacking this thing. And it keeps on moving far away. That works! <laughs> At least defeating each of its parts can also help you gain, gain more energy. Beating it, you obtain a deck capacity to increase and learn the Diamond Dust Command style. Thank God that's over. It's my fault her light was stolen. It was because I was weak. I'm sorry. I'll get your light back. Once I learn to stand up against the darkness. Why would Master Xehanort imprison the light? The purest hearts of light. Do they hold the answer? <laughs> Seven pure hearts, each completely void of darkness. Such a search may take some time. Terra, you sir have no idea. By completing this, we obtain the Fairy Stars, a keyblade that provides a balanced boost in strength and magic. And with it, Enchanted Dominion is finally done. For Terra Story, anyway. By completing it, you have access to two new worlds, which is the Dwarf Woodlands on the left, and the Castle of Dreams on the right. And that will be it for this part of Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep Final Mix. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did, and if you did, please be sure to hit the like button, it really does mean a lot to me. Next time we'll be moving on to the Castle of Dreams. This is Mega Man NJ signing off, peace out. I got grinding to do.